The Lagos State Government is continuing with its campaign against all forms of gender-based violence and sexual harassment. Addressing residents of Ibejuleki, the Supervisor of Women Affairs and Poverty Alleviation, Abisola Aziz, called on parents to report cases, especially against children. Plus TV News correspondent Lobby Koko Yedoko has more in this next report. Gathered in this hall are residents of Ibejuleki area of Lagos State. They have been brought together by the state's domestic and sexual violence agency, DSVA, to be sensitized against all forms of abuse and violence in their community. Adorned with crested polo shirts with the inscription, it's on us to end sexual and domestic violence. Participants paid rapt attention as officials from the DSVA took time out to educate them. Move from the face of blaming the survivors and move to the act of ensuring that the perpetrator themselves gets, you know, arrested and the necessary justice is served. That's the only way the community as a whole can, you know, help the survivors. Because if the community keeps on harboring the perpetrator, keeps on defending the perpetrator, then the survivors will just, you know, be languishing in pain. There is nothing embarrassing if you are sexually abused or your daughter or your son is being sexually abused. You need to speak out. You shouldn't be the one to be ashamed. It is the perpetrator that ought to be ashamed of his bad behavior. So they shouldn't be ashamed to tell their story. They shouldn't be ashamed to let people know what has happened so that perpetrators can be brought to book and we can put an end to these vices. The session was interactive. Some parents called for stiffer penalties against sexual offenders to serve as deterrents. We just want government to take this as a serious case with serious measure of punishment. Anyone or anybody found guilty should be punished accordingly. Even that punishment should, should not be a jail term, if possible, dealt penalty, because they were destroying the future of, of these children. And some of these things is, I will call it a stigma that can never be cleared in, in their life. These children, they get some of these, get exposed through all these their phones that they look into and the kind of pairs of friends that they have too. So the parents should be able to know the kind of friends their children are with so that they can be able to monitor them. They also identify social stigma as one of the factors preventing victim from coming forward to seek justice. This is a taint in the series of grassroots enlightenment campaign by the DSVA, which is aimed at getting the buy-in of all to end the vice. Love Ikuku Uyedukun, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.